Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and this is a quick video to explain how to add a Microsoft Store app or a Universal Windows Platform app to a preferred graphics processor when you have a gaming machine or if you have more than one graphics GPUs in your PC. So here on my Acer Nitro 5 I've got two graphics GPUs and in regular 32-bit apps or 64-bit apps it's easy to just you know right click and force a GPU on a, a program for example and most of the time they are chosen pretty well automatically the problem with the um, apps that are from the Microsoft Store is that often they are not choosing correctly so for example I have half Asphalt 9 a game that is a racing game and the GPU selection is always defaulting to the Intel GPU which is not the one I want because I see a difference in performance so there's a way to actually change this in Windows 10 May and November 2019 update so I'm going to show this with the November 2019 update if you want to add an app to a preferred GPU what you do is you go to your settings app and in your settings app you will go into system and in the display options go down to graphics settings so here you see that I have asphalt 9 that I've added in iPerformance so basically when I click here and I click options uh, it tells you that power saving GPU is going to give you Intel or I performance is going to give you in NVIDIA GeForce GTX this is what I want how did I add this well you simply choose the universal win, um, app then it says you're going to select an app so search for the app that you want to add here in this um, GPU for example uh, bubble which uh, 3 saga which I never play but anyways it's an example so bubble witch 3 I added here so you click the add button and now it's added at the bottom next to my asphalt 9 and if I click options I now have system default power saving or I performance and I click save and that means that the next time that I run this app it's always going to use the Nvidia GPU in my case um, there's coming up in the future versions of Windows 10 a better way of doing this they're actually making this easier unfortunately one of the negative side of this is that it's kind of difficult when you choose classic apps you got to browse and find the app itself in your program list which is really not the best way to do things but you can you know go and select an app and force it like this if you know where the executable is you can actually add it by doing this but honestly that's kind of uh, you know kind of a, a hassle if you want and what I usually do is I always um, you know will right click and choose the proper GPU uh, manually in the context menu but you can of course add the classic app in that way if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thanks for watching